so interesting. Um, I, I actually was talking about this with friends. I mean, what's there's so much going on here. The first thing is this woman was trying to be complimentary. The article does go on to say how successful Shonda is and how, uh, you know, the women are strong and multilayered, blah, blah, blah. But unfortunately, even if it's unintentional racism, it's still racism. And I think <laughs> she, the, her first, her biggest mistake was not taking that article to, she got, there's got to be at least one black person at the New York Times. <laughs> she could have run this by and said, like, to say, is this coming across the way I intended? Um, <laughs> Because, you know, I don't Is that your white person? No, 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 this in my own career so many times where people will say, like, I was up for a movie where the role was written black, and then they were like, well, they're not going to put a black person in that role now because they put Morgan Freeman in the movie, and that's enough black people for the film. I mean, it happens all the time that, like, well, you're black, but you're not black, black. And I think you have to think about what you're saying when you say it, because saying to somebody, if I had to date a black girl, Aisha, it would be you, is not a compliment. It's not a compliment. Oh. No matter what your fat has, but that has been said to me so many times. I'm like, thank you. Yeah. Who is who's forcing you to date black people? Is that a thing? Does you want? Does you want to weigh oh, in no, here, honorary just... black person? <laughs> <laughs> I was just like personally offended for Viola Davis because I find her no less beautiful, beautiful than Carrie oh. Washington. Hey. Is more beautiful than anyone on this planet, any race. Like, that's, that's not right. a good comparison <laughs> for anybody. Right. But Viola Davis, she's gorgeous. She's and I just, I, it's like, I just think, yeah, she should have been more careful. I understand the same thing. She's trying to make these points and make Shonda look good, but it's a bunch of backhanded compliments. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Well, uh, let, me, uh, let me just say quickly what bothered me about it was you listed all these women and all these characters and all these people, and it, it sounds like you want us to all be mad because either I'm not you or I'm not enough me for whoever. Mm -hmm. Why didn't she just say that Chandra Rhimes is not an angry black woman, but she's passionate, she's prolific, and she's powerful as the executive producer that's creating great characters. Not as an angry black woman, because I'm wearing my fabulous hair today, but I'm going to speak as an American. America is proving that it can handle beauty in all shapes and forms, and it means Viola Davis. Can I just also say, uh, race aside, the idea that strong men are powerful and strong women are angry is just a basic well, sexist black idea. Well, black You got to be black. I'm saying I'm even not black. black. <laughs> you got to be black and angry, Aisha. That's not who we are. No. That's not who Shonda is. That's not, that's not an accurate depiction you of know why? anything about her personality or perspective. Yeah. It's because they're threatened by us. There you go. <laughs>